We have live team coverage. NBC4's Darsha Phillips has spent the day at the scene. We also have NBC4's Vicki Vargas with the latest on the investigation from the city of Orange Police Department. Vicki. Yeah, Chuck, police now telling us they actually have surveillance video of this alleged gunman from inside Unified Homes. And they say they think that's the only business he was targeting. Police say this is 44 year old Aminadab Gaxiola Gonzalez, caught on camera inside the area where he allegedly shot and killed four people, including a nine year old boy. I got a call uh, after I got home from work. And. Um, and they, they, they told me it was a shooting at the complex where my dad's office is. Police say they were on scene within two minutes of the first 911 calls. Multiple people reporting shots fired at this Lincoln Avenue office complex. Shots were reported to have been fired by officers within minutes of their arrival. But police say that initial gunfire was done through a locked gate secured by a bike cable lock. Officers on scene used bolt cutters to break through and take Gonzalez into custody. He is said to be critical. According to Luis Tovar Jr., his father, Luis Sr., is among the dead. He was a hardworking guy. Always put his family first. Um, always put others in front of himself type of guy. He tells us his mother, Blanca, was also shot and killed along with his half-brother, nine-year-old Matthew. A fourth victim was a female co-worker. The fifth person was Tovar's sister, Genevieve, who was rushed to the hospital. She remains critical along with the suspect. Now, the way investigators describe all of this chaos, they say it was Genevieve who was trying to protect that little boy. They were caught in the courtyard, and they say that is where they were gunned down. Live in Orange, I'm Vicki Vargas, NBC4 News. Thank you.